A little bit later this month, you and the family can enjoy a day at the Waterfront Botanical Gardens for their Kaleidoscope Fall Festival. The event includes arts, crafts, vendors, and so much more. Joining us today here to talk about it uh, is Adult Education Director Kat Rivers and Mary Wheatley with the Jefferson County Master Gardens Association. It's that time of year, ladies. It Isn't is. it the best? Like, it's you get so excited, excited to plan these things. Because we get to come here and just talk about, like, free fun stuff yeah. with people. And we and love that. And that's the thing. It's free. <laughs> yes, what exactly. a great, because I feel like a lot of these events is fantastic. Families head into the fall. They're looking yes. at what they want to do with the kids, and they're like, "Oh, what do you this do on costs, the weekend? This costs, but right? To come again to go to the botanical gardens and see how beautiful, which it is, is also free, yeah. just coming to the gardens itself. Um, so but yeah. tell us all about it. I'm going to yes. pick up this flyer. If that's okay, okay. That's or fine. if you want to hold it, well, yeah, it's I'll hold just it right there. So we're here to talk about kaleidoscope mm -hmm. here today. Um, September 16th and Mary is going to be one of our booths there because she's a master gardener. Mary, do you want to talk a little oh, bit about Mary, what you're going yes. to be teaching? Uh, Tell us teaching? about that. Well, what the cool thing for me is at the Kaleidoscope event is it's taking something that we grow in our gardens, a plant, yeah. and showing a product that comes mm. from that plant. And um, this beautiful pumpkin um, can be turned into pumpkin bread. Oh, yes. And we have th four other booths there. They're going to be similar plant to product. Mm -hmm. And I think it's great because it teaches kids mm -hmm. that you just don't go necessarily and get a can of pumpkin, <laughs> but you can actually grow it in your garden, process it in your kitchen, and make and something make beautiful and delicious out of it. Healthy and clean yeah. too, yeah. right? Right. You right. know what's in it as exactly. well. Exactly. Will you show people like how you made the pumpkin bread and demo those steps too, or just be able to talk and answer? We'll have it questions. set up okay. with the components of oh, it. Perfect. And the plant, the pump, the finished pumpkin, and then all the things, the cool things that go into it, the spices, yeah. the exotic spices, and the natural ingredients that you have around your kitchen too. Yeah. And then they'll get to yeah. sample the pumpkin bread. Even, even better, right? <laughs> yeah. And you have a couple of different uh, do-it-yourself do booths kind of like set up where you can make things. These are beautiful. Oh, and you made these, these up and show these too. Yeah, we. It's beautiful the sketchings or drawings. Well, or, they're actually they? made from putting flowers or petals onto a piece of watercolor paper, another sheet of paper on top, and pounding them with a rubber mallet, and these images come up, and you can be very artistic about it. Um, in this particular one, it was a, um, a black-eyed Susan that I just laid the petals down and some leaves, and because the button on the black-eyed Susan was so big, I couldn't use it, but then when the print was done, I could take and rub the brown color from the button or the cone mm -hmm. and make this and then these it's are so beautiful you could frame yeah. these yeah. I mean, they're, they're and stunning the kids, from plants. The kids are going to have great plants. time with that right yeah. and they can say I did this myself that's and this right is, this is how and I yeah. think that's the the beauty of being able to visit the this festival is completely learning things that are new yeah. and, and keeping the kids kind of engaged in, in all that fall Thank you. can yeah. offer right it's just uh, looking at the world again and reminding ourselves how our plants are giving back to us too and how we can give back to them. So that's what the free day is, is going to be about, um, just looking at our plants and the products that they are attached to. Yeah. So what does it look like on the property right now? Kind of give us a sneak oh peek boy. of what is beginning to bloom. Yeah, it's right. Do you uh, get excited? You're like, hey, in this corner, day. this is starting yeah. to bloom and this is getting ready. Well, our monarchs too are coming oh. through too. So they have their little parade right now and you get to find their caterpillars. Um, and then after hours, if you are curious about what we're doing and the insects that we have, crawling about our facilities. We have our free programs mm -hmm. and paid for programs with our fall classes for adults and kiddos. Wow, that's a lot. I know. I'm going to pop Which that is one wonderful. Back out. Sorry, we're Any, no, that's <laughs> right. from just, you know. <laughs> <laughs> don't mind us. <laughs> From garden. yoga to mindfulness in the garden yeah. to watercolors, um, watercolors to gardening classes, repotting to orchids. canoe classes, just like anything that you can think of that is botanically related, we uh -huh. try to do for our adult learners. Wonderful. At a cost that's, again, reasonable, great we price point. Because, that's you know, goal. the wonderful goal of being able, like you said, mm -hmm. to visit the gardens for free of charge yeah. and walk around and enjoy everything is just a bonus there, too. Um, and we can go waterfrontgardens.org for all the information you about sure the can. event September the 16th. It is. Yes. It's a lot going on in September, We're right? It's crazy. It's yeah. just a lot happening. And, and I know you all are looking forward to this yes, um, we as can't well. Wait. A family program September 16th, and then we'll just keep 
going along with other programs. What do you have yeah. beyond that that you're looking forward to that we can kind of t like give people a yeah, teaser that you're working on? We have our uh, gala coming up in November. Um, we have a speaker event also, and then and then we jump right into Gardens of Glimmer, which is you know we all holiday. Yes. So that's all of December. Yeah. And again, everything I love too about what you all do mm -hmm. is it has a hands-on component. Oh, of learning, you. right? Yeah. Thank and, you. and I think it's something, again, like this is something for all ages to learn. Yeah, I might absolutely. be challenged in this, but what a beautiful um, project from the pumpkin bread to um, the artwork. I like to say adults like to get just as messy as kiddos. They do. So anything we do as kids, they'll still do it. And chances absolutely. are we haven't done it in a while. Yes, and our, exactly. our brains need yeah. to be challenged in this way to yeah. do something creatively. But uh, great to have you both by. Thank, Thank you so much. Thank Once you. again, just go uh, to waterfrontgardens.org to learn more about the Kaleidoscope Festival.